It starts with silence. Deep below the Pacific, a submarine slips quietly through the water, invisible to satellites, hidden from sonar, and cloaked by decades of naval tradition. For generations, submarines have been the ultimate shadow weapon, impossible to detect until it's too late. But now, something is changing. China claims it has built an artificial intelligence system that can spot enemy submarines in minutes, not days. If true, this could rewrite the entire balance of power at sea. And for the first time in history, submarines, the pride of America's deterrence strategy, might no longer be untouchable. Submarines are built around one core idea, stealth. Nuclear-powered boats can disappear under the ocean for months at a time, carrying ballistic missiles or hunting carriers. Even with modern sonar and surveillance, tracking them is a nightmare. During the Cold War, entire intelligence networks were devoted just to guessing where enemy submarines might be. But what if that cat-and-mouse game is coming to an end? In 2025, Chinese researchers revealed progress on what they call the AI Ocean Net. This isn't a single system, it's a web. Picture thousands of undersea sensors, floating buoys, hydrophones, and even satellite-linked drones, all feeding data back into massive AI networks. On their own, these signals would be too noisy and chaotic to use, but with AI, the noise becomes a pattern, and the pattern becomes a target. So how does it work? Traditional sonar tries to hear submarines directly, but oceans are messy. Waves, storms, whales, and ships create clutter. The AI ocean net doesn't just listen, it interprets. It studies micro-changes in water pressure, unusual sound reflections, and even electromagnetic disturbances. Where a human operator might see nothing, the AI stitches millions of fragments into a map. Suddenly, the invisible becomes visible. Reports suggest the system can pinpoint a submarine's path in near real time. That means a US sub trying to sneak through the South China Sea could be tracked before it even knows it's being hunted. Why is this so dangerous? Because America's nuclear submarines aren't just another weapon, they're the backbone of deterrence. Right now, the US relies on its ballistic missile subs to guarantee a second strike if attacked. In theory, no enemy could wipe them all out because they can't be found. But if China's AI ocean net can locate these subs, that deterrence starts to crumble. Imagine the implications. Suddenly, the US can't assume its submarines are safe. China, meanwhile, gains confidence to push further into contested waters, knowing it can neutralize America's trump card. And China isn't just talking, it's building. Over the last decade, Chinese shipyards have been pumping out surveillance ships, undersea drones, and seabed monitoring devices. Satellite images show long lines of buoys stretching across the South China Sea, part of what Beijing calls the underwater Great Wall. With AI now running this network, it transforms from a static defense into a living adaptive system. The South China Sea, already one of the most militarized regions in the world, could effectively become a Chinese-controlled surveillance zone. Every submarine, whether American, Japanese or Australian, risks being tracked the moment it enters. But here's where it gets even darker. This isn't just about submarines. AI ocean surveillance can also track undersea cables, mines and unmanned vehicles. That means China could potentially monitor internet lines running across the Pacific, giving it both a military and economic edge. In a conflict, it could sever or hijack communications before the first missile is even launched. And don't forget, this same technology could be exported. Imagine Beijing selling AI ocean nets to allies like Pakistan or Iran, suddenly giving them submarine tracking power they never had before. Overnight, small navies could become submarine hunters. So how does the US respond? For one, the Pentagon is pouring billions into countermeasures. American labs are developing AI camouflage, Systems that let submarines spoof their acoustic signature, blending into background noise so even AI can't tell the difference. Others are experimenting with decoy drones, cheap underwater robots designed to create false trails and overwhelm enemy networks. But the bigger question is psychological. For decades, sailors trusted that when they dove deep, they were invisible. If that trust disappears, how does it change the way wars are planned? Will admirals hesitate to deploy subs into Chinese waters, fearing they'll be tracked instantly? Will submariners second-guess their missions, knowing they might be walking into a digital net? The race isn't just technological, it's strategic. China wants to control the first island chain, a stretch of territory from Japan down through Taiwan and the Philippines. If it can dominate those waters with AI surveillance, it can deter U.S. intervention in any Taiwan conflict. Washington, meanwhile, sees submarines as its ace card. Take that away, 
and the US suddenly looks much weaker in the Pacific. This is why officials in both nations are treating AI ocean surveillance as one of the most critical fronts in the AI arms race. It's not flashy like drones or missiles, but it could decide who controls Asia's seas for decades. And let's not forget Russia. Russian scientists, though limited by sanctions, are working on their own AI sonar networks in the Arctic. With melting ice opening new shipping routes, Moscow wants to ensure it can monitor NATO submarines near its northern bases. Combine that with China's progress, and we may be looking at a world where submarines, once the ultimate stealth weapon, become relics of the past. So what does the future hold? Picture this. The next great naval battle may not even involve torpedoes or depth charges. It could be fought silently, with AI systems competing to out-detect and out-deceive one another under the waves. Submarines laying digital traps. Are INETs countering with predictive models? A war of algorithms fought in the cold, dark ocean. And for ordinary people, the stakes are enormous. The global economy depends on shipping lanes that pass through contested waters. If AI surveillance makes those lanes unsafe, the ripple effects could touch everything, from oil prices to internet speed. Let me leave you with this. For over a century, submarines have been the ultimate ghosts of war. Silent, invisible, unstoppable. But now, a new kind of ghost is rising. The AI net, unseen but all-seeing. The question isn't just whether China can track submarines, it's whether the age of undersea invisibility is ending forever. Because if AI can see into the deep, then the oceans, the last refuge of secrecy and war, may no longer hide anything at all.